sparka.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make money selling your music online. Number one, and it's not necessarily only going to be about how to sell your music, your um, artistic creative music, but it's going to be how to produce music for commercial purposes. And I'll tell you how much money you can make. You can make $10,000 if you license your music and your music shows up even on an airplane or a theme park or a baseball stadium, for instance. Number two, you can make up to $20,000 if your music is used in an iPhone app or game. $20,000 if your music shows up in the game, and I'm gonna show you how to do that. Uh, number three, you can make $50,000 if your film, if your music shows up in a film, trailer. Not, it doesn't even have to show up in the film itself, it can just show up in the trailer for the film and you can make about $50,000. You can make $100,000 if your music shows up in the nationwide commercial, and I'm gonna show you how to do that as well now. Sparka.com slash music. Sparka.com slash music. How to market your music online. This is going to be an intense how-to video. It's going to be a step-by-step -step detailed video that includes links to resources and contacts for you to actually be able to talk to and contact people that you need to reach out to to be able to sell your music. So let's go through this step-by-step. -step. There are... There's two different ways to make an income, make a living, and make a good living selling music. Number one, selling your creative work. Number two, selling for commercial purposes. Now you might think, well, if I sell my music for commercial purposes, which I'm not really even sure how, um, you might think, isn't that a sellout? I, I, I want to do creative work, I want to do... Well, there, there's, there's two kinds of... Uh, there's two ways to look at it. Number one, if you just want to write for yourself, if you just want to be purely creative just for yourself, it's kind of like writing a diary. Nobody really, nobody else really has to like what you produce. But if you want to make money, if you want market feedback from your work, then it's going to have to be commercial. So it's either got to be commercial for the purpose of selling just the music itself, or it's got to be commercial for the purpose of selling another product, maybe selling a music video uh, or, or a commercial or an advertisement or even an airplane ad. And I'll give you an example of how these things work. So, first of all, if you're going to promote your, if you're gonna promote and sell only your music, this is how you do it. Here's five steps. I'm gonna go through this very quickly. I'm gonna read from my notes on my screen. Number one, you need to create a top 100 list of the most popular mus musicians who've already got the same fans that you want. So, you need a top 100 musician list of people that produce music similar to yours. So they're basically your competitors. Number two, you need to be able to contact them, reach out to them, and offer them a deal and say, hey, if you feature my music to your fans, to your Facebook fans, to your Twitter followers, I'll do the same. And if they like your music, number one, and if they have a decent enough, large enough following, number two, then now you've got instant fans built in. You give them some of your fans, they give you some of their fans. But here's, here's the cool thing. Let's say you have 5,000 Facebook fans. The most number of fans that you can give away is 5,000 fans total, right? Now let's say each of these 100 musicians that are your competitors technically, each have 5,000 fans. If they each give you the most number of fans that they can each give you, 1,000 people or 100 people, 5,000 fans, that's 500,000 fans that you're gonna have after you're done with this process. Number three, generate a top 100 list of the most popular music bloggers and do the same thing. Reach out to the bloggers that talk to the people in your industry. Most of these bloggers are gonna be uh, celebrity type bloggers that, uh, that talk about the actual singer-songwriter, the actual performer, the actual musician, rather than the music itself. Uh, kind of like uh, gossip bloggers. Get to know them and reach out to them and, and present your music to them as well in a way that's valuable so that they can offer something more entertaining to their readership. Number four, contact them. I'm, I'm, gonna, leave, I'm, the, I'm gonna, gonna leave this one out. Uh, you'll be able to read this on the actual website. I'm gonna give you the link for the website in a second. Number two, how much money can you make? So this is part two. You'd be surprised that not only can you make money by selling your music, you can make money by selling someone else's products, services, or even album. 
here's a, here's a sample. First sample. You can make zero dollars to ten thousand dollars, ten thousand dollars, by licensing your music to a sports events, b theme parks, three TV commercials, number four airplanes, airplanes. You, you know when you sit in an airplane, they give you those headphones. You can press play and listen to all this music. If your music gets played and they track this, they record this. If if people tune into the channel that your music is on and listen to your music, you actually get paid. Pretty cool, huh? The way to do this is to contact a music licensing agency like BMI or ASCAP. The link to these people are going to be at sparka.com slash music. I'm going to give you links to be able to contact these people so that you can actually get your music licensed. Again, sparka.com slash music. Uh, number two way you can make money. Remember the last one was $10,000 max in, in general. The next way is you can make $2,000 to $20,000 if your music is used in an app or a video game. That's kind of cool, isn't it? Kind of like the Super Mario Brothers theme song. Imagine if you came up with a Super Mario Brothers, Brothers theme song, you'd make much more than $20,000, guaranteed. You'd make about four or $500,000. That's how Danny Elfman makes his money, literally. He sells his music to, for major video games. He sells his music to major motion pictures. Which leads us to number three, where you can make money. You can make between $5,000 and $50,000 if you get your music included in a film trailer. Now, this is the cool thing. Your music doesn't even have to be in the movie itself. It doesn't. It can just be in the film trailer. And the film trailer is made by a different team than the actual production team that creates the film itself. So the links to, to the people that produce film trailers, again, you'll find links to these people. I've got 100 people that you can contact. Go down the list, get to know them, get to know what kind of movies they're working on, get to know what kind of theme they're looking for, and pick from your music library and propose it to them. Send it to them. They need your music anyway, so it's not even going to be like you're spamming them. You're, you're offering them something that they're already looking for, so you're helping them out. They'll love you, if, especially if your music fits the trailer that they're trying to develop. Uh, and you can make between five to fifty thousand dollars if your music gets featured in the trailer. Links to these people: sparka.com/music. Again, number four way you can make money is a national commercial. You can make between fifty thousand dollars to a hundred thousand dollars. If your music gets used in a nationwide commercial, for instance, like anything from a hair shampoo commercial to, I don't know, uh, a Nike ad or a McDonald's ad, for instance. How you reach these people? You need to be able to contact the ad agencies that have these major household brand accounts. The top, if you can go to adage.com, A-D-A-G-E.com, and get a list of all the biggest ad agencies in the world and see which major commercial producers, which major product manufacturers, which major companies in the world are working with which major ad agencies. But to be able to contact these people that work at the ad agencies, you're gonna need their contact list. Once again, I've got a link for you, sparka.com slash music. Let me summarize this for you. If you license your, if you sell your music on Literally, if you sell your music on iTunes, you'll make about 66 cents, literally, per song that you sell. 66 cents per song that you sell. If you license your music and it gets all the way out to maybe even an airplane, you'll make $10,000, uh, maximum average, $20,000 if your music is used in an app or a game, especially if that app or game takes off and gets used a lot. Generally, what you want to do, if you don't have faith in the app or game, uh, don't ask for licensing or royalties, just get an upfront payment. If you have faith in the developer and the fit game itself, ask for royalties, you'll get money every single month paid out. Number three, film trailer. Film trailer, get your music in YouTube trailers. Get your music in, in TV commercial trailers. And that's $50,000, $100,000 if your music gets into a commercial. You can actually make more money producing commercial music than selling your creative music. The only thing I ask, if you liked this video, I'm going to include a link at the bottom of this page where I have all the contact links for you. Just give me a thumbs up. Just give me a thumbs up 
on this particular video as well as the video that um, I need more thumbs up on. And I'd appreciate that. Hopefully you found this information valuable and look forward to helping you where we can. Sparka.com.